You know, I got a wheelbarrow. I don't have a wagon. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, hey girl, hey, my name is Kristen and I'm so glad that you decided to tune in. As you can see from the title, we're doing a Shein slash Forever 21 try on haul. This haul is gonna be like a basic slash vacation wear because your girl is going on vacation next week. So stay tuned for the content because it is coming. Now, same deal as last time. If anything that I put on in today's try on haul stands out to you, it will be in the description box below as long as I can find it on the website. So if you girls wanna see what all I got from Forever 21 and Shein and how it fits my body, let's just go ahead and get right into it. So to kick this haul off, we're just gonna start with accessories so we can get all of those out the way and get into the good stuff which is the club the first accessory i got are the nude sandals with this gold chain detailing and i just feel like these can go with a wide array of outfits just because they are nude another thing that i really really like about them is the square toe box i feel like it's most flattering on my foot for them to be like between nine to eleven dollars this was like a steal i couldn't pass them up okay i will tell you let me just say Forever 21 sandals are not comfortable, okay? They're not. But for the price that you're paying, especially with this 50% off, it's kind of like you can't pass them up. The next pair of sandals are these orange jelly kind of slippers. They remind me of those shoes from when you were a little girl, those jelly sandals. <laughs> they take me back to my childhood. They're just these very simple orange, very, very flimsy sandal, okay? I treat these like pool shoes because these are uncomfortable. It feels like you're walking on the concrete. However, they are cute and they were $9. So just be aware, Forever 21 shoes are just not the most comfortable, okay? And they're not the best, the best quality. When you're in a hurry and you need something that's gonna go with that fit, Forever 21 got you, okay? They got you, especially with this 50% off sale. Honey, you can't go wrong with some of these. Now, you might be hurting a little bit, but it's okay. If you don't plan on wearing them for longer than like, I don't know, three hours, you should be fine. But moving forward with accessories, the next two items are just these claw clips, honey, the claw clip hairstyle has been all the rave so i had to get my hair so i had to get my hands on some i had to honestly i have been obsessed with the claw clip hairstyle like it has me in a chokehold okay these are fire like the clear one i have been using the mess out of it pretty good quality like i would have expected for the springs to snap out already you know what i mean because my hair is pretty thick so trying to stretch a clip around that sometimes can really be it can be an ordeal so the fact that these last I'm really feeling it. I believe accessories were like 50% off and clothing items were 30% off. So don't walk, run to your favorite 21, okay? The only bag that I have in this haul is from Shein and I've just been seeing this everywhere. Isn't it so cute? I just ordered this because like I said, I am going on vacation and I feel like this is the perfect like vacation bag to go with everything. It just gives beach, you know what I mean? And for the people worried, it does come with a little satchel inside of it so no you can't just see directly through it you have that and it slides right in there like so and you're ready to go this bag shockingly does fit a lot in here i was able to fit my phone my camera and like a mini tripod in here don't get me wrong it was bulging but it fits so that's all that matters unless you are that person who just wants to carry a backpack which i am but not every outfit calls for a backpack so i bought this to go with certain outfits so that way i can still take my phone and camera with me while i'm out okay most of this jewelry came from forever 21 there is another store but for the most part all of my jewelry came from forever 21. now that i'm looking at this i'm not gonna even lie to you i feel like it's a little bit gaudy i don't know if i like it like that i got this k necklace it's gold of course with cubic zirconium so i don't know how i feel about it i mean it's cute or whatever but now that i'm looking at it i don't know how i feel i got a stack of bracelets which these are really chunky i was thinking maybe depending on how they look i could always use them as anklets because honey these are thick i just got one simple anklet i just love very dainty gold jewelry like this i feel like it just really elevates a look even if you're not really trying it shows that you put in a little bit of effort i'm all about looking like i gave the most effort without actually doing it you know what i mean last accessory that i have isn't from forever 21 or Shein. this is from this store called lovisa it's supposed to be like fine jewelry without the expensive cost i got these cute little ear stackers and i've never seen anything like this at a jewelry store <clears throat> where they sell the earrings already stacked for you that is so cute do y'all see these earrings i don't have enough holes in my ears to put all of these in the way that they have them on this ring that's okay 
because I'm gonna make it work. I'm some kind of way gonna shove all these earrings in my ear. Now, moving on to the fun part, the clothes. We are going to start off with tops. I'm just gonna scoot to the side so that way I can insert the try on portion here. Some of these things still have tags on them because I haven't worn them and then other things, they're so basic that I've went ahead and worn them just to run out of my house. So either way, like I said in the intro, everything will be linked down in the description box below. Starting off, we just have this blue crop top. When I saw it laying there, it was really honestly the color that drew me in because as y'all can see, there's really nothing just special about this top. This this looks like sportswear. It is kind of built like a sports bra. The material is knitted or ribbed and it is scorching in Houston. So I need as minimal clothing as possible this summer. So this is right up that alley. Next is something kind of along the same lines. It's just this black crop top, same ribbed knit material. And honestly, there's not much to say about this because it's just a basic crop top. I actually got this to replace one that I had from Shein a while back, but y'all know, if anything gets in the dryer from Shein, you might as well throw it out, cause it's shrunk, it's gone, it's done. And that's what happened. What I like about this one, I didn't even notice it at the time that I bought it, but it has a high-low situation going on. For it's a different look. Now this is an actual sports top. This was in the sportswear section. I was really drawn to it just because I've been looking for tops to wear like this inside of the gym, and now that I know that Forever 21 has them, I will definitely get more because this one's not seeing the inside of the gym but it's just this white ribbed crop top the difference between this and the other two this has a built-in bra so you don't necessarily have to wear a bra with this shirt it's just nice to not always have to wear bras this in my mind will obviously be sweat wicking and because it has that bra built in you won't be able to see any nippling with normal white crop tops sometimes if you choose to not wear a bra you can see everything you can see everything. Because it has that bra built in, you're all good. <laughs> so next, I'm actually very, very excited about this because I love, 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 love this color. And it is just this Shein bodysuit. This thing is so comfortable. The material is kind of almost like a swimsuit, so it's very cool. The only thing about this is there's no support. I personally would wear these with like a sticky bra or like the sticky cups that you can use. The Y'all know what I'm talking about. It doesn't rise too high on the sides, so it truly just looks like a top. I got this in a large. Wow, I didn't even tell y'all the other sizes. Those three shirts, I believe I got them in a large. Either way it goes, Everything in this haul is either a medium or a large, okay? Pretty much my normal size. This is for sure in a large just because, again, like I told y'all in my last haul, I have broad shoulders. So for me, I have to get my shirts or tank tops in a larger size just so that way I have enough material to stretch across my shoulders. Like a bodysuit is essential because you can throw on anything over this and call it a fit. Get the right shoe in the right bag, you're good. Next top, I am like super excited about this. I love the pattern. Love it. It is just this long sleeve swim top. I have seen this all over Pretty Little Thing. However, that button down is what, like $30, $40? This is the same pattern, same oversized look, but it's considered a swim top and I paid $12. I love this shirt. I've worn it already and I got so many compliments. On it. Like, I am here for that top. Y'all don't understand. I love that top. This is more of a vacation wear top. It is just this knitted wrap top. I don't even know how to explain it. It has that waffling material and then it has um, these tassels with seashells, little clasps to go behind the neck. It is a very, 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 very cute top. The thing about this top is it gives the look, it gives the girls what it needs to give. However, it's just not as supportive as I would have thought. Not as I would have thought because honestly, what can you expect looking at this top? I just don't know if it's gonna work y'all, I don't know. I really don't know. I'm still very much so on the fence about this, so we will see if I wear it. We will see how I feel about it. But like I said, if you have bigger tatas, definitely size up in this because I thought a medium would be perfect for me. But we clearly see that it's not. But also, I feel like a large would just be way too big. I feel like it would be way too baggy. I don't know. Order that at your own discretion. Jean is kind of hit or miss with your sizes. Like, you have to do your research on these pieces. Like I told y'all in my Zara try on haul, I love a good denim short. Denim. I love a good denim jean. I love a good denim short, okay? I just do. All of the bottoms are from Forever 21. I got these light wash denim shorts in a size 28. I want to say these are the concert shorts. I love the little 
distressing and they fit so well they're a little bit loose but they look nice on me I feel like they fall at the perfect length with my waist they're just very flattering denim shorts they're not too too tight to where I feel like I'm restricted and I can't move I got the same ones in black I didn't notice this with the light wash denim these like highlights that the shorts have I feel like it adds a little bit of depth instead of just being flat and I've been needing some black shorts some new black shorts because I've been growing that dumpy in the gym and now none of my stuff fits i just got these boyfriend shorts in light denim and then i got them in the white and i'm going to show you on the light denim because y'all really can't see the white on camera as you can see they have the distressing on the leg across the thigh and at the seam i just like the raw hem it gives like an edgy look it gives sexy all of the denim shorts i got in a 28 except the black ones the black ones i had to get in a 29 i'm not sure if that's because of the color it's a little bit tighter but i did have to get a 29 in the black next are just these flowy cream shorts. they kind of look like a skirt i feel like that's the idea that they're trying to go for they are tight around my waist they're a wide leg short best way I can explain it I got these in a size large because these fall a little bit funny on me they're not necessarily high-waisted but they're also not low-waisted so I did have to get them in a large just to accommodate for where they fall I am really looking forward to wearing these now moving on is just these cream flowy pants um, they do have pockets on the back they remind me of like gaucho pants the material obviously they're not a gaucho pant because we're not in 2010 we're not in 2008 i got these in a large now these do scrub the floor when i saw that and the fit of them i was sold because normally when i go to forever 21 a lot of things stop like right above the floor i don't hate that but i would prefer if my stuff scrubs the ground you know? moving into two pieces the first thing i got is from forever 21 it's just this workout set or sports set as they like to call it um in this frosty gray color like this accent detailing on these pants and the shirt is what really drew me in but then the fit is what kept me there because normally when i go to the gym i'm used to wearing like an actual an actual crop top or sports bra and shorts or a crop top and leggings or something like that i'm not used to having a workout set that that goes together like this one and this i'm not gonna lie this is super flattering like when i put this on i was expecting to hate it and i was like you know what let me just try this on for, for shits and giggles. Like, let's just see what it looks like. And if I don't like it, oh, well. I had already made up in my mind that it wasn't going home with me. Then I slid it on, and I was like, oh, hold on. It's giving body. Legs and hips and body, body is what it was giving. <laughs> so, I bought her. Now, I'm not going to lie. When I got her home, I was really kind of on the fence about her. I wanted to take her back to the store because I felt like I didn't, I didn't need her. But do we really just need anything? No. So, I kept her because she's different she's different she's cute and i feel like she'll serve me well both at the gym and outside of the gym so this is definitely just like a basic to run out the house to go to the gym wake up don't know what to put on i'll put this on because you already look put together so that's why i love two pieces because it's already that's your whole outfit right there you don't have to put much thought into it you don't have to do too too much to get dressed all you have to worry about is hair face and accessories you know what I mean? So that's why I love a good two-piece. Moving forward from that, honestly, the pattern, the pattern screamed at me. As I was walking by, I did a double take. So it's just this bandeau top with this pattern. And then the matching, the matching shorts. I feel like on a tan on me, honey. Oh, beautiful so this fits so good like, this is such a relaxed fit but it's still so cute and i also love 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 the pattern on here it just screams summer screams vacation and so that's why i bought it the rest of these things that i'm going to show you are from shein and this is pretty much like the vacation stuff this thing is just this tropical palm fond skirt and crop top set now y'all really can't see it right here but y'all will see it in the try on look at these colors i love this color i told y'all green has been like my obsession this summer it gives me lilo and stitch at the luau practice let's get into some things the skirt fits great skirt mm, couldn't ask for more now this top is where it gets a little awkward because it like puckers around the side boob area and so it kind of spreads out i don't know how to explain it y'all will see here i thought about maybe getting it tailored so that way it's a little bit tighter but honestly 
I don't care enough. I really don't care enough. It doesn't look horrible. I'm not gonna worry about it. Like, I'm not about to try and break my neck to go get this altar before I go on vacation because honey, I leave next week, so not gonna do it. I probably could have dropped this off earlier. Than Procrastination is a B.I. I love the color, love, love, love the pattern. That's another one. You put it on, you feel good, you look good, and you didn't do too much. That's the running theme of this haul. Y'all, my camera decided it wanted to die, so hopefully the angle is still about where it was. Last thing I remember we were talking about was this colorful two-piece halter set. I believe I was seeing it being ordered off of Amazon, Boohoo, pretty, not pretty little thing. I think it was Boohoo and Amazon, but honey, I found it on Shein for $12, so what are we talking about? This thing right here, this is my favorite. Out of the whole haul, this is my favorite thing because it just fits so good. Like, it just hugs my body. And then, I'm one of those people, I love color on me. I was definitely a black and white type of girl, but recently, putting more color into my wardrobe has really just inspired me to keep going. You know what I mean? It just looks so good. It fits perfectly. It, the shorts are high-waisted. To an extent, I did get this in a size large, so the top is just a little bit big. But if I would have got a medium, these shorts would have been, they would have been too small, okay? And let's just leave it at that. They would have been way too small. I think I first saw it, I saw it on Instagram on like a pack with me, and so I went on the hunt. And then I saw it on Shein, and honey, I grabbed her up. Moving into dresses. These are, these are pretty exciting, I'm not gonna lie. Forever 21 to have this, what I'm about to show y'all, I was shook. I saw this, I was like, <gasps> Forever 21, you're coming up. It's just this floral dress. Now, the dress stops about midway, so I called this like a midi length dress, and this is supposed to be like a satin type of dress. This dress I got in a size large because it does, I don't know, I just want it to be a little bit safe. I didn't want this one to be too, too tight. But let's take a look at this pattern. Let's look at this pattern. As y'all know by now, or should know by now, I am a whore for patterns, okay? Like, I, I love it. Like. I will gag, die, and come back alive over a nice pattern. This is so nice, and I feel like it could double so many ways. You could wear it to brunch, you could wear it to a nice dinner, you could wear it on a date with your man, you could wear it going out with the girls during the day. It's so many different ways to wear this. Kind of cowls in the front, it just adds like a little bit of sexiness to it. I'm very, very, very pleased with that dress, and I'm very excited to wear her because she looks so good, as y'all can see. Keeping up showstopper dresses, cause honey, I feel like that dress, when you walk in, even though it's simple, people are gonna just be like, where's that from, you know what I mean? And it's from Forever 21, who woulda thought? Crazy. The next two dresses are from Shein, so this first one, y'all seen this, don't act surprised. This, let's get into it, like this dress, this dress is hot. If you're trying to break some necks, this is the dress for you. The way this just hugs every curve and accentuates it, this is perfect. For it to come from Shein, be so thick, and seem to be made pretty, pretty well. This is like Shein Premium. <laughs> like, this is fire. It just looks so good. Y'all see it. I don't even have to say anything else. It looks so good. Y'all see how thin these straps are. My only concern is that over time, those are eventually gonna start wearing down. Otherwise, this dress is a 10 across the board. I'm lying. It's like a nine and a half, and that's only because it is a little short. If you are dragging any kind of wagon, you're gonna need to size up in this because I promise you a whole booty cheek is gonna be out. This dress I got in a size medium. Now, like I just said, I probably should have sized up because it is a little bit short. You know, I got a wheelbarrow. I don't have a wagon. So this, I get I get by. This is my new going out dress. I definitely can't wait to wear her out. She's gonna be a, br a neck breaker, not a neck turner. She's gonna be a neck breaker. Moving on, this one is a little bit more tame. However, it's still gonna show off the body yada yada. It's just this basic green halter neck medaxi. It does have like a ribbed material. The only thing about this is I find that because it's a ribbed material dress it's not forgiving it doesn't really hide any stomach that you might have from the side honey you're gonna look snatched you're gonna look good you're gonna look amazing if that bothers you then you might want to size up but honey me i size down i believe this is a size small i wanted it tight i wanted it to suck me in okay it does everything it needs to it is a very flattering dress for the curves it's a thick material and it has a lot of stretch all right y'all so that's gonna conclude today's haul i really hope y'all enjoyed kicking it with me like i told y'all in the last one i really do enjoy doing try on hauls i do enjoy it so if you did too be sure to give this video a like like I said I am going on vacation so also be sure to hit the notification bell so that way you can be notified when I start dropping that content cuz honey next week we're out okay we're out so be sure that you're notified so that way you don't miss any of that content and be sure to subscribe because honey I know if you're back here for this one you're already hooked so go ahead and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next one